I've been invited to speak uh, about this a ligament stitch, uh, which was invented uh, actually many years ago, I think approximately 1983. And I, uh, David Hungerford, who, who's my senior colleague, uh, advanced the idea of tightening the medial side of the knee uh, for management or in severe valgus deformities. The idea was uh, to move the capsular sleeve and the medial collateral ligament distally and uh, I began to think about how we could improve that fixation. Okay, so here's a diagrammatic representation of a bad valgus deformity with a stretched medial collateral ligament. I felt we had to have a better way uh, even to pull the thin sleeve of tissue and to hold it uh, knowing the longitudinal fibers uh, would uh, not be a, a very good fixation when we they would not be adequately fixed by the use of a staple alone. Next. So again, I wanted to pull the tissue. I wanted to be able to maintain a tight hold on the tissue uh, and not do uh, anything that would purse string it together with a suture. So I was about three blocks away from the hospital driving the car thinking about this when it hit me that locking loops in a suture would grab the bundles uh, and uh, uh, they would allow me to, to pull this uh, sheet of uh, capsular tissue together with the ligament distally. Uh, so for the first couple of years I, I used it uh, and we uh, began to evaluate it in the laboratory for publication uh, purposes. Uh, there seemed to be no particular concern or problems with the suture. Uh, so here we have uh, uh, three of the publications. You can perhaps uh, enlarge them on your own and uh, and get to them. Uh, here we were uh, with the bovine uh, product that was actually uh, implanted into people back in those days. Uh, and uh, you see how the stitch works uh, and you see how the ligament suture side has been able to pull it through uh, a very securely fastened uh, soft tissue staple.